Metro Bank send money to BPI. How to transfer funds from Metro Bank to BPI via mobile app online. And if you are new to this channel and you want more helpful videos like this, please click the subscribe button. Gamit ko ngayon yung cellphone ko and magka-transfer ako from Metro Bank to BPI. Install ko na rin yung Metro Bank app dito. Kung hindi ka pa nakakapag-install ng Metro Bank app, you can download it from Play Store or App Store. So I'll go ahead and tap this. And I'll log in with my username and password. Uh, by the way, kung wala ka pang online account with Metro Bank, we created a video about it. You may click this i button to check that video. And I'll click log in. For your OTP generator, sa next video na lang natin to explore, I think this is more applicable sa mga kababayan natin na wala dito sa Philippines. So I'll tap maybe later. And also for this, maybe later. So ito na yung account ko with Metro Bank. Ito yung current balance ko and ito yung account number ko. Uh, para makapag-transfer dito sa bandang taas sa kaliwa, may three lines. I'll tap this and tap transfer to other bank. And I'll transfer via Instapay. Uh, right now, zero yung fee, both for Instapay and Pesonet. Ang kaibahan nitong dalawa is kung gusto mong mas malaki yung i-transfer, like more than 50,000, piliin mo yung Pesonet. Pero hindi siya real-time mag-transfer. It may take few hours or one day or so para mag-reflect yung pera dun sa pinagpasahan mo. Unlike for Instapay, real-time siya, pero ang limit niya for uh, a day is up to 50,000 pesos. And since maliit lang naman yung transfer ko, I'll choose Instapay. And later on, ito-check ko rin kung real-time talaga yung pag-transfer. And since first time ko magka-transfer sa BPI account na pagpapasahan ko ngayon, itap ko tong one-time transfer, so itap ko tong transfer button. And for bank, I'll choose BPI. Ito siya. And for account number, uh, ilalagay ko rito yung account number sa BPI na pagpapasahan ko. And make sure na tama yung account number na nilalagay mo rito. And for beneficiary, I'll leave it individual. And for the rest of the details like first name, address, and purpose, I'll provide the information about the recipient or yung mga karisib ng pera. Siya yung bank owner ng account. And since sa akin nakapangalan yung account na yun, uh, ilalagay ko rito yung details ko. Pero kung sa ibang tao nakapangalan, yun yung ilalagay nyo rito. And for email address, pwede ko itong palitan to mobile number. So I'll tap this, use mobile instead. And ilagay ko rito yung mobile number ng recipient ng pera. And I want to save this as beneficiary. Let's say I want to transfer money sa account na to next time. Masisave siya sa list of beneficiary ko. So, from there, pwede ko nang itap yung BPI and hindi ko na kailangan i-enter manually yung details like account number and yung name ng bank account owner. And I'll tap next. And yes, this is my account. So, I'll tap this. And I'll transfer 500 pesos. Again, zero yung fee for this transaction. But normally, may bayad siya. Then, I'll tap next. And for remarks, optional lang naman to, pero lalagyan ko na rin to ng details. This is message to recipient. So, I'll put in MB to BPI. And also, lagyan ko na rin yung amount. And click submit. And hintayin ko lang yung OTP na masend sa phone ko. And here's the result. Uh, transaction is in progress. And also, nakareceive na rin ako ng SMS or text from Metro Bank na, na successful na yung pag-transfer ko ng 500 sa BPI. So, yun yung i-check ko. So, right now, 5,000 na lang yung pera ko dito sa Metro Bank because of the transfer. Nabawas na yung 500 na nilipat ko. So, i-check ko yung BPI online account ko. And ito yung old balance ko. Na-open ko na to kanina, kaya andito pa yung old balance ko. So, i -re refresh ko to by tapping this. And nadagdagan na siya ng 500 pesos. Kanina 11,400, ngayon naging 11,900. And dito sa transaction history, andito na rin yung 500 na tinransfer ko. Wala pa siyang date, unlike dito sa baba, because masyado pang recent yung transaction. And that's it! If you can think of other videos na pwede namin ituro online, feel free to provide a comment below. And also, please like this video if you think nakatulong tong video na to. May iba pa kaming videos about money transfer, you can check this. And in case you're interested, may mga videos din kami about money investment. You can start investing sa maliit na halaga. And this is Lou from Invest Library. Until next time, bye bye